It's the morning of October 30th. I'm getting ready to head out to film the Me and My Film Contest. Pack three cameras, got four of my friends to help me out. Uh, the person that inspires me is Polaris Castillo. He's a multimedia artist. He uh, draws, paints, makes films, and even music. I think I have a good idea for the short documentary, so I just uh, hope it goes well. Yo, what's up? Yo, what's up, man? How's it going, dude? Mm -hmm. uh, what's up? Good, you're good. So we're just gonna, you know, talk about you talk today. Talk about huh? art. Can we come in and set up? Is sure, there a place for it? Yeah. So art, why why do you make art? I don't think I really have a choice. It just uh, bit me when I was young. It's kind of like breathing. If I don't do it, uh, if I go like days without doing it, I feel like fidgety or I get anxiety or something. So it's like something that I have to do. It just comes down to people relating to something that they see and feeling like they're not alone uh, and feeling that same emotion. It's about making someone go through an experience and not just entertaining them. You're just not touching one person, you're like making so many people around the world uh, feel something special. That is worth all the, all the risk and all the money and all the, you know, all the hard work. This is how I see your, your body of work. Okay. In your beginning stages, it was like a little more weird and quirky and like yeah. out there. Yeah. And then it gradually became... Yeah, a little more focused, yeah, a little, little more... Focused. Yeah. So, so why, why is that? I think it's just, uh, uh, it comes down to the evolution and like in the beginning being more experimental. Yeah. And trying to be a little more weirder because you can afford to be weirder when you're trying to find yourself, trying to find your voice. Yeah. Have you found your voice? I feel like it. And I feel like those, the first ones are weirder because I was struggling to find what I was trying to say. There's always something strong that I'm saying, or I hope that is strong. It, it's really good to have that to motivate your writing or to motivate what you're doing. It all circles back to what you're trying to say, and you never run into any roadblocks or writing blocks that way. I think it's also something I like doing is to uh, switch between different mediums because it keeps your, your eyes fresh on whatever you're doing, and then you come back to it and you look at it a different way. Mm -hmm. Because when you're too involved in it, you, you lose that objectivity. It's incredibly important to have a, a crew uh, that you trust that are obviously really talented. Because they can be talented, but if you don't get along, then it's going to show. And you can't make a movie by yourself, so you need those connections to always go to. Filmmaking is all about being a, a family, a group that you mesh with. Clarice, the, the reason I asked you to do this uh, project was because, you know, you inspired me and, like, like your artwork inspires me and, like, like your, your drive is, like, what inspires me because you create so much all the time. Mm -hmm. So I think you have something that you can um, draw for us today? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, okay. I definitely do. What is it? Uh, it'll be a, a charcoal drawing. Mm -hmm. uh, nice little cosmonaut piece. Cosmonaut. Yeah, one of classic the, Polaris one of the classics. Cosmonaut. Yeah. I've always wanted to have like a video of me doing one, but yeah. it's like hard to do it myself. Yeah. So uh, I'm curious to see how you capture that. 